This is Mike Nolan from nextstockusers.wordpress.com here with the uh, next stock first generation and I've been charging it uh, overnight and assume you can see the green light there um, it's all charged up and ready to go nothing's plugged in uh, right now so according to the user guide that came with it if I hold the power button down it will not power up unless something is connected to it and that very much is the case the power light comes on uh, and then goes off after a couple of seconds so that seems to be functioning just fine so <clears throat> the email that went out asking about uh, whether or not uh, the power button worked with something plugged in what I'm going to do is unplug the power plugging in HDMI and oh, a 50-50 chance and USB to the Microsoft wireless display adapter now that that's plugged in you can see what's kind of happening here I will press the power button and let go nothing happens press it again it sounded like it was clicking a little bit which I've heard before don't know if you can hear that in the video or not but so holding the power button tapping the power button and nothing now the thing I've noticed is is that oh, well, the Bluetooth is now flashing but the power light's still not on. Um, if I temporarily plug it in, I think this is kind of a bit of an issue for someone that wouldn't have the um, power adapter with them on the road. But I, I'm not going to turn it on, I'm just going to unplug it. And now I'm going to hit the power button still nothing my understanding is is that if this is green it's charged that's well, fully inserted green light so now if I hit the power button I'm kind of thinking we got power. So the power is on, Bluetooth is flashing, and <clears throat> the uh, Microsoft adapter is booting up, so to speak. So um, now the next part of this is that as you can probably see the power lights are flashing the display is on it's ready to connect it's all fine and well now if I pull the power it should stay on it does stay on um, power is pulled uh, no green light on the side but you got the power lights and the display so now <clears throat> I think the interesting thing is if this is going to be at all consistent for me here should be able to power it off I believe yep, it's off now if it acts like it has been previously if I turn it on now so now it came back on power lights on 
booting up and there's no power connected but now it works so not really clear to me anyway why it just won't work without kind of a power reset of the um, power adapter so it will <laughs> work eventually but it's like the power adapter needs to kind of uh, hot set it before it will work on its own so now <clears throat> oddly enough if I uh, turn it on and off um, as long as the battery holds a charge um, and it doesn't I haven't timed it yet but it doesn't seem to hold a charge all that long uh, now well see there you go um, I've noticed that there is kind of a sweet spot with the power button oh there we go see I and it crackled so not really sure what to think about that um, <laughs> as you can see I pressed the power button several times um, now it's acting a little bit differently it's flashing a little bit differently again I couldn't honestly say if that's the Microsoft adapter or the power supply or the battery because again the power supply is not connected um, but it is firing up on its own um, yeah kind of strange I guess the next series would be <clears throat> to see if I powered it off how long could it stay off before it wouldn't turn on again without kind of bootstrapping it with the uh, power adapter so anyway um, hopefully that might help the next stock crew or the engineers and or any of you users out there uh, this is Mike Nolan from nextstockusers.wordpress.com uh, if you have any comments, it'd be interesting to hear them. And signing.